Experiment number 36. Titration between sodium carbonate and hydrochloric acid using phenolphthalein and methyl orange indicators. The objectives of this experiment are to learn the shape of the titration curve for the titration between a solution of sodium carbonate which acts as a diprotic base and hydrochloric acid and to investigate the pH ranges of the equivalence points and detecting them with suitable indicators. Introduction This reaction takes place in two steps. The first step takes place in the basic medium while the end point of the second step is observed in the acidic medium. Phenophthalein changes its color from pink to colorless in the basic medium while methyl orange shows its color change from yellow to red in the acidic medium. The chemicals and equipment that are required to carry out this experiment are wash bottle with distilled water, sodium carbonate, Phenophthalene indicator, methyl orange indicator, pipette bulb, hydrochloric acid solution, watch glass, pipette, burette, spatula, volumetric flask, white tile, Conical flask, eyedropper pipette or dropper, funnel, electronic scale, and sand. First place a well cleaned watch glass on the electronic scale and make the reading of the scale zero. After that weigh accurately a 0 0.2 gram sample of sodium carbonate. Next, using the measured sodium carbonate solid, prepare the sodium carbonate solution. Use the spatula and the funnel to transfer the solid to the volumetric flask. Next, by using distilled water, rinse the remaining solid in the watch glass and the funnel used. By adding distilled water, dissolve the solid completely.
after the solution is dissolved completely make up the solution up to the mark by using distilled water This is the sodium carbonate solution that we have prepared. Transfer 50 milliliters from the sodium carbonate solution that was prepared earlier to the titration flask using a well washed pipette. Next, fix the well washed burette to the burette stand as shown here. Fill the burette with the hydrochloric acid solution. Make sure that there are no air bubbles in the burette tip. And after removing the air bubbles, fill the burette up to the zero mark. After that, add a few drops of the phenolphthalein indicator to the titration flask.
Place the titration flask with the sodium carbonate solution under the tip of the burette and add hydrochloric acid solution slowly to the titration flask. Stop the addition of acid at the point the color of the solution becomes colorless and record the reading of the burette. After the solution becomes colorless, add a few drops of methyl orange indicator to the solution and continue the titration. Stop the addition of the acid at the point at which the color of the solution becomes orange and record the reading of the burette. The volumes of hydrochloric acid required to titrate all the sodium carbonate present in the solution that we have prepared is shown in the table given here.